Good day to everyone. We are here somewhere in Makati for us to show you our newly installed made nano system. Let us walk through the parts. From the fish tank using a submersible pump, we will pump the water up to 2.5 meters to the topmost part of our NFT. Then it will zigzag downwards passing through each NFT pot, fertilizing each plant before it goes back to the fish tank. Now here we see the bell siphon. We'll remove the cover for you to see what's inside it. You see the water level is maintained one inch below the gravel bed and it goes back to the fish tank. We control the bell siphon using this valve, control the flow from lower to higher to maintain a constant flow that will make the bell siphon work. Here we will show you how the bell siphon will start and stop. This is the start cycle and we will wait for it to cut off or suck in air to cut off the vacuum. The sound you, you are hearing is the bell siphon cutting off. Here we're planting basil cuttings. We have some cuttings here. We'll put cocoa peat around the stem and then put place the basil cutting inside a net pot with holes in it. Then we'll put it inside our NFT growing pipe. So that's how easy you grow inside an NFT growing pipe. So how do we feed our fish here at Maine? We use a sola or a floating weed to feed our fish. A sola is very easy to grow. What you need is a basin or a container that contains 50% tap water and 50% fish water to provide nutrients for the Azola. Azola is a nitrogen fixer, so it will absorb nitrogen from the air. You go to a very sunny part in your garden or in, in your area, and then prepare your Azola tank, and then place the Azola on top. The Azola will double its number every day so you can feed half of it to your fish every day. Again, thank you very much for watching our videos. If you want to learn more about aquaponics, please subscribe to my YouTube channel, Madodel, or add us on Facebook, Modular Aquaponics. Thank you very much for watching. See you in the next videos.